Hey everyone. So today we have a 14 by 18 canvas. This is a level two, it's a nicer canvas. But we are going to be using a new toy that I got while I was at the beach. I believe I got this at Tuesday morning. But it has a funnel built into the bottom. But I love the cup because it has that that in the middle. So I thought we'd try a pour with that. Um, you don't really need to use the funnel in there, but I'm going to be using it so I know how many ounces of paint I have in here. So we should need nine ounces to cover this canvas. So um, I will be laying white down. Um, not real thick, but I will be laying white down so this has something to flow on. So we're going to be using Dioxazine Violet from Soho, Elizirian Crimson from Soho, Primary Red from Soho, Cad Red Light Hue from Liquitex, Soho Cad Orange, and Soho Cad Yellow Light. So we're going to start with the purple. I'm not going to put any um, silicone in the cup. But see how this, um, I like this middle part, so this ought to be interesting. <laughs> Okay, so that was just for the purple, but I, the rest of them I'm going to lay on one side. And hopefully that'll go around. Oops, did you see that? Oh, hope I can find it. Well, we'll find it probably when it comes out. Okay, let's get our yellow. I have been away, so my paint's probably got a little dried in the top. So we are at seven inch seven ounces of paint. So we should be fine. I am going to lay some white down on there. I'll use my spatula. I have this in my Amazon shop. It's great for spreading paint when you're in a hurry. doesn't have to be perfect because we're going to be tilting. And I don't have to worry about my sides right now. Okay, let me just move that a little bit. Just to get the weight away from the middle. All right. So now we're just going to pour it right in the middle and see what happens. These all have silicone in them, so we will get cells. I should torch that a little bit. Let's see if we can find our uh, clumps. Didn't see him. <laughs> All right, I'll get a quick torch. I'm 
me see if that's one there. Found it. <laughs> I found it before we stretched. Okay, let's give a stretch. I'm going to flip this over because it's so cool inside. Maybe I can get a skin out of there. Now, I could have done a purple background, and that would have saved us all of that yellow or white cells popping on the edges. But I like that look when I'm doing something that I want cells in. Or you could just not put a base down. But then you remember, you're going to be folding over. And you may lose a spot that you really like. So that was the perfect amount of paint as far as color goes. That's pretty cool. So we are going to torch this and then we're going to let it sit because I think we're going to get a lot more cells coming up through that purple, the violet. stretch that some more but let's let it sit and let's see what happens I'll be right back okay so we got a lot more cells through here and we have some that are starting here um, I think I need to stretch it just a little bit more to open this up so I think I'm going to come this way and try not to get too wonky I love the way that that cup laid that paint down though because it was kind of like a paint kiss. So I'm going to go ahead and dump that red off and then I'll come back. My runoff is so pretty. I can't wait to pull skins out of there. All right, so I'm gonna leave it right there, I think, because I balanced it out as well. And it's actually in the middle, which I don't normally like. <laughs> Let me torch this one more time. This is gonna continue to develop. Um, more of the yellow will be coming up through. Yeah, I think that's it. I'm not going to mess with it anymore. But on the next video, I'm going to use that funnel. And we're going to play with that funnel. I have a few ideas for this little guy. So stay tuned for that. Okay. So if you haven't subscribed yet, click below and click on that bell. You'll be notified when I upload my next video. Click like and share and leave a comment. Join our group on Facebook, The Parage Posse with Christina Welch. Check out my page on Facebook, Christina Welch Art. Um, that's where you'll find all the announcements about our channel, what's coming up, and what was posted each day. And you can leave a review there as well. Um, join us every Monday night live, 9 p.m. Eastern Time. We have a great time. We do four or five paintings. 
and a mini auction here and there. And we show paintings that we've done during the week if requested. Um, also shop with us on Amazon for all your paint pouring supplies. Uh, this measuring cup, like I said, was purchased at Tuesday morning. So if you have a Tuesday morning next near you, check that out as well. And also um, Etsy for all of our paintings. And also our auctions. Every first Sunday of every month at 8 p.m. we do an auction. And you can get your favorite paintings at a reasonable price. So thanks so much for watching, guys. And we'll see you all on the next one. Bye now.